my people, sons and daughters of Elgan, this much I vow. The history of these days will be written in blood. By crushing the armies of our enemy, by seizing the weapons they thought to turn against us, we were fighting for our very existence. But if there are those who would deny us peace, refuse us our rightful place in the universe, then we will unleash such terrible vengeance that generations yet unborn will cry out in anguish. A spokesman for ISA High Command had this to say on Vasari's latest outburst. The dictator Vasari plays a martyr while threatening the peace of the universe. Listen to this shit makes me want to he break something. Down, the Ever the news. diplomat, Rico. Damn. Colonel Templar. I'm off the field this time. So I'm looking to you and Seb to get it done. <laughs> you know we're on it. Good luck, Sergeant. Sir, the ISA also confirmed that the second wave of the invasion fleet is due to launch imminently. They will arrive in orbit over the Helgan capital in approximately two weeks, by which time Fleet Commander Templar expects the first wave of the assault force to have dealt decisive blows against Vasari's forces. I'm sure we all wish our brave men and women good luck and Godspeed. Diplomacy has passed. The Hellgas do not reason. They started this war when they invaded Vector, and it's up to us to conclude it. The enemy may shatter our bodies, but they cannot break our spirit. Even now, they advance on our home world to seize by force what they cannot claim by right. They cannot imagine what awaits them. We will smite the invaders from our skies! Though they sweep over our lands like the sands of winter, never again will we bow before them. Never again endure their oppression. Never again endure their tyranny. We will strike without warning and without mercy, fighting as one hand, one heart, one soul. We will shatter their dreams and halt their nightmares, drenching our ancestors' grave with their blood. And as our last breath, tears at their lungs as we rise again from the ruins of our cities. They will know Helgan belongs to the Helgans.